Both Dan Gable and Kale Sanderson have legendary coaching careers. But who's the GOAT? Let's ask the fans. Dan Gable or Kale Sanderson? It's a great question and one that's going to go down for the ages. This conversation will be had for a long time. That's hard to say, but I would say probably Dan Gable just because he did it for longer. I got to go with Dan Gable. I like I like the old school style. I'm going to go with Kale. I'm going to have to go with Sanderson. He's had a lot more success, I think. Definitely Dan Gable. I'm going to have to go with Dan Gable. I named my dog after him, so I'm a little, I'm a little biased. Gable for sure. Personally, I have to go with Kale. I don't like it, but Sanderson, all those guys come come here to wrestle at the tournament. Dan Gable. I'm gonna go with Gable. I feel like Kale's still writing his book. Probably gonna go with Gable on that, just because he's you know, changed the sport of wrestling and has his dynasty at uh, Iowa. He had a good program back when he was coaching, and Sanderson hasn't reached that level yet, even though he's had a lot of success in the past 10 years. Gotta go with Kale. I think it's Kale Sanderson. I'll go Kale. I gotta sway with Sanderson right now because of how dominant Penn State has been in recent years. I think since 2011, Penn State is 45 and five in the semifinals, which is just insane. He's got put many guys in the finals the past couple years, winning national titles, coming for another one this year. I think he's just the better coach. You guys think same thing? Sanderson, or you disagree? Oh, man, I want to say Gable, but I have to go Sanderson, man. But Kale did as an athlete, and now as a coach, it's so I'm gonna go Kale too. Right now, I still gotta give the nod to Coach Gable, just doing what he did, 21 Big Ten titles in a row. You know, all those national titles. You know what, I'm gonna have to say Dan Gable, man. He's just like, you know, kind of changed wrestling. I'll go Kale, what he's doing right now, he's not done yet. I think in the end, it will be Kale Sanderson, but right now, Dan Gable. Crazy is Gable retired early, so it's, you know, who knows what would've happened if he kept going, but right now, it's, it's gotta be Kale. And he's figuring it out in a whole different generation that I think Gable would've, the, the grind of Gable style necessarily wouldn't have translated the same. Well, as of 2022, Kale Sanderson has coached 30 national champions and won nine team titles compared to Dan Gable's 45 national champions coach and 15 team titles. But you make the call. Who do you think is the better coach? Leave a comment below. And if you're not already, make sure you're subscribed to the Fanco Wrestling YouTube channel.